Hi everyone, uh, we have been working on food logging in specific. So there are two problems which when you're trying to log food. It's easy if you have food labels, it's easy if you're cooking at home, what, what happens when you're going out to the restaurant? And how do you sustain this habit? What's the first thing you do when you go to a nice restaurant and you get a, a, a meal served to you? <laughs> okay, <laughs> what else? <laughs> Take pictures. I have my Facebook feed filled with uh, pictures of food all the time. So the market's big, <laughs> I'm just going to move on and focus on the left side of the page. So you click a picture on Facebook, Instagram, share and the app trolls through all of it and we are able to give you a summary of what kind of food you've been eating, what are the composition, how is the nutrition and at the end of the day you will be able to get recommendations on say reduce the rice portion, increase your vegetables you're still eating the same kind of food. On the right, what you would be seeing is how do you keep people continuing to track food and take healthier options. So what we were thinking is, okay, uh, let me throw a picture of food at you and do you know exactly whether it's healthy or not? Is it a carrot? Is it closer to a carrot or is it closer to a slice of cake? So when you are able to estimate how good a meal it is, you're able to make better choices. So that's the gamification aspect which also helps us uh, monetize, which I will be talking about very shortly. These are a couple of snapshots which Rahul will explain. So there are four key aspects we look at. First, how are we going to train the system? Image, image identification is very hard. So we have various databases which we can look at and specifically one thing which we wanted to personally build was work with restaurants, get them to give us pictures of their food and give us how the nutrition value is. That's going to be flashed to customers and if you guess it right, you're going to get a voucher which means we're giving them referrals. Second, how are we building a sustainable ecosystem which is exactly what I said. People play games, we have referrals. And how do we spread the word? We have influencers working with us. Finally, how are we monetizing? professional advice. Once we are able to get the system more sophisticated, we can focus on chronic disease patients and give specialized advice. So I'll just uh, take you through a few of the screens we built for, the, for our system today. Hold on. So when you have pictures that you log into Instagram and other social media, what you don't realize is other than the pictures, you also have the time the picture was taken and also where it was taken, a GPS location, with which we can actually smartly determine which, which restaurant you would have probably had the food at. So here's a home screen. You take a picture, log it on Instagram, and this is what the thing looks like. So this is a, supposed to be a mobile app. You'll see the image. It will be able to find out where the picture was taken and with that it will know which which restaurant it was from and as Shami already mentioned we have the database of users a uh, database of the different items available at a restaurant so we will be able to determine um, its calorie content obviously uh, and also like she mentioned we also have a game we have gamified the system for people to guess so this is an image and people have to guess on a slider from a cal uh, from a carrot to a cake what's what do you think is the protein content of this dish and you take a guess and if you get it right then you get a voucher so this is pretty much the yeah, main system but behind the scenes we are able to collect more data and determine against different backgrounds so suppose this is for an average user but suppose you're on a low carb high fat diet or you're a diabetic you have different requirements and those requirements will be mapped in and you'll be able to determine whether the meal you've eaten is good for you or not so that's what we do. Thank you.